Airport. It's a little jet lag, feeling a little weird. But I think it's safe to say this is one of our favorite dishes ever. Right? I'll show you guys when it comes out. And if any of you guys remember our road trip last year, if you were following us then and you saw it, high five to you. <laughs> So I got this savory waffle and I got some tofu scramble on top. And then Chris got the savory waffle special, which is... Barbecue pulled jackfruit, smoked kale, The very last thing is crispy onion straws. Crispy onion straws. We took a little work break to eat. What'd you get? A breakfast burrito. So we went to Ideal Market, which is like a Whole Foods, um, and I got some oatmeal and some big flag flying in. And then I brought my to-go wear. So it is bamboo utensils. So I have a spoon. It comes with chopsticks, um, a fork, and then Chris is using the knife for his burrito. I don't know, I just want to show you guys that. Um, if you guys follow me on Instagram, you would have seen me share this. I got it from Follow Your Heart. Um, we visited their facility, and they are the first plant-based, what is it, first plant-based company? Or food to, manufacturer? To go zero waste. To go zero waste, and their whole like workplace, factory, everything's zero waste. And it was really cool, it was really fun. So, it's a random, random share, but. We're not having like a really exciting breakfast. We didn't go to a restaurant, um, but we're going to head to Denver today. Um, probably have lunch there, so we're saving our appetite for something extravagant there. The hotel we are staying at is the St. Julian Hotel, and they have a restaurant like in the hotel called Jill's. And what were you gonna show me? Yellow means vegan. Oh, so they have a bunch of vegan options. We're gonna eat here on Friday. That'd be cool, they have flatbread. Yeah, the coconut green tofu looks good. Yum, jasmine rice. So we came here last year and everybody keeps recommending we come back. So we're at this place called Zeal and um, we are trying to figure out what to order. I will show you guys what we get, but this is the next exciting thing we're doing here in Boulder. I got the macro bowl with the tahini dressing and then Chris got the conscious, what is it called? Conscious garden And some potatoes. Chris, do you like beets? No. <laughs> we'll see how this goes. to my room to grab my camera because I totally forgot to vlog this. Hi guys, good morning. Um, Chris and I are going to, hold on. I wanted to wait for the elevator to open because if someone was inside, I wasn't gonna vlog. This is a weird light. Um, but Chris and I are going to an all vegan spa treatment here at the St. Julian Hotel. I'm so stoked. I'm a little late, I had to run up and get my camera and all this stuff, so. Ooh. Excuse me. <laughs> We're heading to our spa treatment, so I will see you guys later. Round one, Conscious Chris got Going in the right pizza. Now. Camera eats first. And then I got some pizza. I forgot what this is, so I'll put it on the screen right now. And then I'm also eating a little tiny slice of pizza as well. It seems like it's a cornmeal crust. Really, really, really good. And then this one has corn, and this one has figs on it. Behind the scenes, we got some more food. Not more food over there. I'm about to be really full, but it's okay. So we got a little bit of everything. Um, 
don't really know how this is gonna happen, but we got a bunch of vegan pizzas, we got some roasted veg right here. Yeah, of course. Um, we have a Napoleon, that's what it's called, um, rigatoni, some fruit, some couscous, some ratatouille. Um, Chris has a cauliflower coconut curry soup. Chris, what do we got for dessert here? No. Hummingbird cake. Caramel cupcakes. Peanut butter oat bar, right? Yeah. Blondie. So peanut butter blondie, brownie. And then blueberry bread or something, and then fruit. So, how full are you? Scale of 1 to 10? <laughs> so, it's our. I guess I'm filming. Fuck! I thought I was filming and I wasn't. The whole time. I did this whole thing, but anyways. Tonight is our first night out in Boulder. What up? It's and uh, it's gonna get a little crazy. No, I'm just kidding. Um, we got some drinks and we're chilling. We're probably bar. we're at the hotel bar, yeah. Or the band playing tonight. Yeah, they're Afro playing some Afro pop. We're thinking of heading over down the street. There's like a salsa night with like a DJ. I don't know. Could get crazy. I don't know what's gonna happen. Maybe this, this will be the first crazy vlog of SSV. <laughs> but we'll take you guys along. I don't know. I don't know what's about to happen. <laughs> So we're out here on the roof. We got Shin right here with the top button button. He's getting all ladies. Top button. Top button is life. Top That's button is life. That's top button is life. Remember that. Love rice. We love rice. <laughs> so I haven't filmed today. Uh, it went out last night, as you saw, and it got a little crazy. And I woke up this morning not feeling well. So we didn't start our day till around noon. We just like ate bread in the room in bed. It was great. And then we went and ate some at this Asian place, I don't remember what the place was called. And now we are gonna head to Denver because we are going to meet up with Jenna. If you guys know who Live Pure Jenna is, um, I wish definitely show her. She was in our New Jersey vlog when we were there. And yeah, I'm just gonna meet up with Chris right now and then I'll show you guys where we go. Stopping by Wong Wei Veg and trying the Krabby Patty, of course. Show this. Damn. I'm gonna have to go outside and snack. <laughs> so, guess what I ran into? Jenna's here. And I'll show you guys what we just got. Got some Palo Santo and it is wrapped in wildflowers and it has a crystal on it. So pretty. It's so pretty. And then I also got this sacred sprite. Smokeless smudge. Oh, that's awesome. Smells I didn't realize. so good. Yeah. Amazing. And Jenna just so happened to be in Colorado while we are, so we had to meet up. And if you guys don't know who she is, live here, Jenna. Come on. <laughs> so we found this truck. It's called Banamanam. Banamanam. I don't know. But it is a banana ice cream truck, and this is like the best day ever, so we're gonna get some right now. I'm excited. Got banana ice cream with peanut butter and chocolate sauce, and Jenna got the same but with uh, mixed berry, yeah. right? Yeah. 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 Got coconut water, I'm feeling better. We went to the room and we did some photography um, for the hotel. So we're here at the hotel doing all sorts of things with him, collaborating with them. And um, one of the things we're doing is uh, photography. So it's been a lot of fun and we did a couple of shots in the room. And now we are heading out to dinner. I think we're getting pizza because earlier we tried to go to a pizza place and we walked and I don't know if I filmed this, but we walked like two miles. I don't think I filmed this because I wasn't feeling well this morning, like I told you. But we walked really far. We got there, it was closed. So, um, pizza's been on my mind all day. And we're going to get pizza. I'm gonna fall going down the stairs. So, I'll check in with you guys when we get there. We are at Pizza Rev, and if you guys have ever been to one, they have vegan gluten-free options. They have vegan cheese. Um, I think they have a, do they have a vegan meat here? Yeah. yeah, they have vegan sausage, I believe, and it's always a quick, easy option um, for on the go. And even just like all um, DIY pizza places, you can definitely get an option. I've never had a problem, so definitely would check this place out. We don't have light, so we're using the phone. Looks pretty bad. Chris, what'd you get? Uh, pizza with a whole bunch of stuff. All right, cool. Mushrooms, Thanks, thanks basil, for telling us. Olives, vegan sausage, vegan cheese, onions, and then I got. Sauce, artichokes, vegan sausage, spinach, sun-dried tomatoes, and I think that's it. Yep. Cool. It's dark, it's dark. Good morning, Boulder. <laughs> You're beautiful. We're about to head out on our bikes, looking cute. Let's do it. Let's go. We're on time. We're riding through the canyons, and 
we had to take a break because we found this. It's so pretty. How are you feeling? Great. That was hard. Really? Yeah. Uphill. <laughs> so before we leave Colorado, we had to make so one more stop in Denver. So we're at a place called Water Course. And it's an all vegan restaurant. Babe, what'd you get? Vegan Cuban, mashed potatoes and gravy. Then I got a macro plate with um, miso glaze, tofu, cucumber salad, um, sea vegetables, rice, and steamed greens. So she's gonna feed me. Mm. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Can we show the meat? How do they do that? So weird. It's so good. That's so weird. Okay, we are wrapping up our Boulder and Denver, I guess our Colorado eats with one more meal at the airport. Um, here's the place called Root Town. Um, it is in Terminal C. And um, what's cool is they have a bunch of vegan options. So we're going to figure out what we're going to get. I'll show you guys what we get. And then we're going to head back to LA. We are starting off with some vegan gazpacho. It doesn't look as vibrant on here, on the camera. It looks kind of yellow, but it's really pretty. All right, we set this all up. Chris is using this to block those lights up there. And we're getting photos. <laughs> Chris, that looks so good. So he got the vegan bento with, uh, what'd you get? Fried tofu, miso salad. What is that? At a moment. There's no way I'm gonna be able to eat this though. No way? <laughs> and then I got the farro salad um, with the basil vinaigrette, some greens, and it looks bomb. Yeah. <laughs> we have little sprinkles everywhere. <laughs> 